hello friends welcome to my channel in this video i am going to discuss introduction to george Eliot and her writing style so किसी भी राइटर की राइटिंग को समझने के लिए उसकी राइटिंग स्टाइल को समझना बहुत ही जरूरी है एंड दैट इज रिफ्लेक्टेड इन हर राइटिंग एज वेल राइट उसके राइटर के राइटिंग स्टाइल उसके राइटिंग में रिफ्लेक्ट होता है सो so, आज हम डिस्कस करेंगे जॉर्ज इलियट एंड हर नावल इज आल्सो पार्ट ऑफ योर सिलेबस एंड दैट इज मिल ऑन द फ्लॉस You may wonder that why also I call George Eliot her, although it's a man name. So the thing is, ये है कि George Eliot जो है Mary Annie Evans, ठीक है Mary Annie Evans उसकी उस writer का नाम है female writer है and she published this Mill on the Floss novel by the pen name of George Eliot, ठीक है उन्होंने एक pen name के नाम से publish करा दिया. या नावल मिल ऑन दी फ्लॉस ठीक है बिकॉज एट दैट टाइम यू नो द पेट्रालकन सोसाइटी था मेल डोमिनेंट सोसाइटी था और फीमेल राइटर को इतनी आज़ादी नहीं थी कि अपने वर्कस पब्लिश कर सके सो so, उन्होंने मेल पेन नेम जॉर्ज एलियट के नाम से अपनी नावल मिल ऑन दी फ्लॉस पब्लिश करवा रही राइट सो विल डिस्कस हर राइटिंग स्टाइल और हाउ दैट राइट स्टाइल इज रिफ्लेक्टेड इन द नावल वो भी हम देखेंगे right and so let's get begin by her introduction her name was mary and evans or you can call mary and evans right she was a victorian novelist translator poet journalist right and she used the male pen name george Eliot to publish her work and then uh, her writing style includes psychological aspects of character or you can say that draw uh, psychological realism right uh, that is a technique in literature that portrayal the realistic psychology of a character or realism and psychological insight of a character by jata hai and uh, and then psychological realism child psychology right we'll see in the character of maggie tolliver as well that is very important uh, psychological aspect child psychology theek hai in characters ki childhood and innocence and things like that and what happens after they grow up how their psychology changes we'll see uh, them in the novel and then inner conflict and mental struggle is there because this uh, mill on the floss it's it's like a autography autobiographical novel and she portrayal herself her life right through the character of maggie tolliver as well that is very important we will discuss separately both important topic hai, right and apart from that her writing style contains sympathy and then relation between characters and circumstances tragic best writing right and we'll see um, the mill on the frost her novel which is a tragic novel right tragic ending is there death of maggie and tom at the end of the novel and she published her novel with a male name i already told you right and then protagonist feminism is there she discussed the problems faced by women at that of that society and uh, the feminism uh, she was an advocate of feminism and her protagonist is the female character maggie tolliver and then so uh, psychological aspect right this is her introduction born on England 22nd November 1819 right so this is biography details of her early life and family life that is not none of our concern right and she began to question religious ideas yes she questioned religious ideas and she also attend the church regularly so religious ke aspects be pai jate hai her novel me christianity ke aspect early writing career and she began with the westminster review right 
so <coughs> she began writing for the westminster review and f1 began working there as an editor take as an editor wahan pe kaam karti thi although chapman was the chief of the forum yeah 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 and then in editing publishing papers and giving reviews and then um, emotional attachments are also part of her life and also reflected in her works as well theek hai emotional attachments ko hum dekhenge and she was also infamous notorious infamous for various emotional uh, attachments during her literary career as well theek hai this is uh, important we'll see right how this mill on the floors is autobiographical novel and successful writing she spot and uh, spot it and admired the realism of victorian novelist in europe and use of male pen name and uh, her famous work includes the adam bat right which gave her success the novel brought evans instant success and fame adam bad that is very important uh, of her work of her novel right and then other things which are important are political work right back in england she wrote the felix halt and it was written about the time of discouragement of the reform bill so some political aspects are also found in her work right and then writing style she wrote from a journal human perspective rather than particularly male or female point of view journal human perspective paya jata hai uski writing mein and uh, right psychology as yes, she peeped into human Uh, universal human nature and highlighted the minute properties of the inner selves means psychology inner selves ye ye cheeze paayi jati and sympathy is there depicts sympathy and compassion towards a a common lot of society and melodramatic effect in her novels tragic can melodramatic right sad endings is tarah ke and melancholic tone right and local dialects the original dialects and features of eliot's writing her use of local dialect in the dialogues of characters and it is to give a realistic touch to the social and educational status of characters and allusion is also found find in her work allusion you know the reference to historical works right she gives several references to historical literary mythal mytha mythical sorry mythological right and then scientific and cultural instances as well unique psychological narrative that is important right narrative voice of avon is unique to her other writers because it uh, because she interrupts the action of the plot to explain the inner motives of the characters right characters ke inner motives inner conflict unke psychology ये चीज़ें इंपॉर्टेंट है राइट न्यू डिबेट ऑन साइकोलॉजिकल इंसाइट एंड देन थीम्स हर मेजर थीम्स इंक्लूड कंपरी स्टडी शिफ्ट फ्राम द सर्टन वैल्यूज एंड फॉर शोर डेविंग यस फॉर शोर शेडोइंग इज अ लिटरेरी टेक्निक दैट शी यूज फॉर शेडिंग यू नो इन लिटरेचर इट्स अ लिटरेरी टेक्निक विच इज यूज टू फॉर टेल और द इनफर अबाउट द अपकमिंग इंसिडेंट as in the mill on the floors we will see this for shadowing that when she get in childhood when she get out of her home and, and to join gypsies her mother may uh, infer she she just surmise that uh, she may uh, drown in the river floors and it's a for shadowing because ultimately at the end this become true right so for shadowing paya jata hai and historical continuity is ko chhod da that's not important right major themes include family love marriage and materialism that is very important theek uh, hai because this materialism is reflected 
extra in the novel mill on the flaws the materialistic need of people and the importance of money or the you can say finance related with money and all of these things right because industrial revolution was at its peak right status of morality yes morality that is concerned with the women uh, that certain uh, restrictions were imposed on women and they were expected to follow certain moralities right religious orthodox religious aspect feeling of love and goodwill and things like that so this is all about george Eliot. hope you understand and in the next video i'll discuss her novel mill on the floss thank you for watching